Hey everybody, it's Rob Nazarian with Talk Android and have the Galaxy Note, which I've already done a short video on before, but I wanted to kind of go over some of the uh, apps that are optimized for the S Pen. Um, it's some pretty cool stuff out there. Now here is the Sooner Scribble. Uh, this is basically a cloud uh, type of application that uh, will take in your Word docs, Excel docs, PDFs, a PowerPoint, and let you mark them up uh, with the pen. Um, so basically what happens is you can load any docs into um, the into the cloud for, for with sooner but also if you receive an email uh, and you download an attachment it'll automatically ask you if you want to upload it uh, so that's pretty cool the only downside is that you have to be connected uh, with data in order to use this but here's a test doc right here um, and you can see there I had folders for what they call projects now here's a text uh, test doc and this is just basically a word document um, with some estimated sales projections for a fake company it certainly isn't mine and basically what uh, you can do here is pretty much mark it up now um, you have the, the the paintbrush so let's just say I want to circle uh, this being a, an important month in the data or whatever now if I want to take the uh, do an arrow and it can select the size move that uh, so if I want to do an arrow and point to something I can go right there like that and bingo it's done and go back to the paintbrush change the color and I can say too low then I can also highlight um, and highlight in yellow so I can go like that and I've highlighted and then I can from here I can save this it'll save the original for me and I can save this and then of course I can share uh, via e uh, email and Gmail and uh, well over Bluetooth and Wi-Fi I'm not sure what that exactly means but basically uh, it makes it very easy to sit there and basically mark up um, documents now the, the one thing I did find out is the highlighting only works in word type documents um, it doesn't work like on a scanned image PDF so um, this is pretty cool and I changed the color of the arrow so we have a different color there this here as I guess basically drawing not really sure exactly what that is, but that's just basically drawing a free, freehand uh, shape of some kind. So, um, basically, this is really cool. This is probably one of the coolest uh, apps right now for the Galaxy Note. All right. So now the next set of apps here we're going to look at is these are pretty much the same except uh, there's a different theme. There's Hello Chalk, Hello Crayon and Hello Color Pencils I think that is. Um, let's just go in the Hello Crayon. These are for kids for drawing uh, and of course there's some different uh, shapes and stuff or stencils that they can draw as well. Every, okay here we go. Um, so basically it gives you the crayons here to choose from and I already was working on one so let's just go new and uh, so you can clear the sketchbook and you can just start with a you know basically an empty sheet but you can also go in the drawing books here and there's colors that you can start with or you can go through here and there's different uh, stuff like there's Halloween and here's some different things here and that's where I got the uh, rubber duck so let's just go into this book sometimes the pen doesn't alright and then let's say um, we'll go with the horsey takes a couple seconds to load I notice too once you click it alright so basically you have your crayons and you have some different options here there's a one marker and there's these markers are in the other app as well 
um, and then you got paint brushes and I guess paint cans and the eraser so but basically this one's for crayons so let's just stick with crayons so we'll go with blue and um, that's how you load up the uh, take that away so you can take that away or just start writing and there you go you can start drawing or coloring in shall we say whatever you want to do now if you want to erase what you've done there's different size erasers and you can erase so not bad um, now let's just go in to the um, chalkboard one this is hello chalk and again it's very basically a similar app you have the same exact layout I was playing a tic-tac-toe game there um, if you look let's just erase this and we'll go into okay so basically let me just do that that was a, basically a designed one with the tic-tac-toe board already there so if I go in the new um, whoops I didn't want to go clear sketchbook uh, board images if they have colored board images in this one and then there's what they call tools um, and the tic-tac-toe was in there so you can already have something that's kind of already there this isn't more for like, like the other two apps you would color in different um, themes so basically you have your different colored chalks and you, they throw in the markers and then the erasers so um, you know you can start writing something and then you can uh, take the big eraser out <laughs> and erase it so that's pretty cool um, and I think uh, kids definitely have fun with that um, had a seven year old over for the weekend and uh, uh, she was having fun with all this stuff so that yeah that was hello color pencil so basically this is the same thing and I believe the sketchbooks are the same as the hello crayon in this one it's just basically you have colored pencils as the different uh, things and there's the horsey so it's the same same sketchbooks uh, same exact sketchbook so anyway so that's the uh, hello chalk hello crayon hello color pencil themes for kids alright the next one I want to show you is comic book now all these apps are available in the Android market there's the Samsung apps um, icon in here in the market that you can go and it'll help you find them but you could search Galaxy Note in the Android market and actually more of them do come up now basically this is to create a comic book so you can forget that right now I'm no artist and there isn't going to be any decent comics going on here but basically you can create um, let's just say you want to these are the different page layouts that you can create let's just go with one page and basically now you can go into captions and you can create a caption so let's just say you want to go with this one and then you can move it and basically there's all kinds of stuff here there's you can throw in um, images of Twitter or no you can you can tweet the, I'm sorry you can tweet that let's go back and you can print and send to Facebook and email and do all that stuff so that's for sharing I'm sorry about that stickers uh, basically uh, there you go the attack off throw that in there and do some different things here crunch and move that around basically then when you're done creating you can go in and draw and you can go in and pick a paint brush and whatever thickness you want and you know you can write something in here and then you can of course you know draw and like I said I am not a comic book artist I'm not any kind of artist so there you go you got the stick figure <laughs> that's about as good as you're going to do here but you could 
if you're any kind of artist, uh, you can have a lot of fun with this. Create some comic books and share them. You can do color changes here, and there's the eraser. Um, so if you want to erase, you get the different size there, and there's erasing. So you've got uh, a pencil. You could do all kinds of stuff here. So um, all good stuff, and just another uh, cool app for the Galaxy Note. All right, now here's another one called Omni Sketch. This is just another uh, version of sketching, um, so you can do various things with it. We'll go in and create a new one here. This one has a lot of different shapes and things that you can do. Um, for example, all right, well let's start with the colors here. Let's just say you want to go with blue, um, and over here you can really adjust things, your opacity adjustments, stroke width, and all that good stuff. Here um, is the foreground, which I haven't been able to figure out how to get that to work. Um, and here there's a mirror mode, so as you draw, it'll mirror it. Uh, but right now, let's just go with none. Um, and then, what what is it that you want to... Uh, your brush shape, and there you go. So like, let's just start with a line. That's pretty simple. But now you go into something like this square you're actually drawing squares of course you have an undo you can do that as well um, you can do triangles you can do whatever links that is looks like little fishes but there are links and now if you do this mirror mode and go vertical you get this so pretty wild uh, stuff here and of course like I said you got the you have the undo so you you can you know do some pretty good drawings again if you're talented you can do some pretty cool things um, oh this is a blend mode I haven't even tried that yet so there you go did I do a great job with that or what so I couldn't draw that freehand if I wanted to but thanks to uh, mirror mode let's go with horizontal as well so pretty wild um, and there's all kinds of different uh, shapes and things that you can do so this is pretty cool it's Omni Sketch and it's available uh, exclusively for the Galaxy Note alright so now here's another one for the Galaxy Note this is called Freenote and with Freenote you it's similar to the S memo maybe takes it up a notch a little bit um, you can basically go in here and create you know different ones and um, right now I'm in paint but let's just say we want to go in with uh, handwrite English basically as you type um, so let's say and it starts putting the words there as I go along now you can undo you can also do a delete function here where it's highlighted and then undo within that as well which is quite interesting um, you can change colors from these different these different uh, colors right here can be changed and you can go in with different uh, pen um, thicknesses um, you can add emoticons so there's a sad one right there and of course you can draw as well you can come down here and say paint and go like that and basically what the handwriting is you can do then what's called freehand um, where it kind of like takes it where well you write and then you click when it's done so and there you go and of course you have the undos that you can do as well now the other thing that you did that uh, this has as well is a widget goes along with it as well and basically this widget 
calls up the last um, you can set it up for different ones so let's just say for example let me just delete that remove this and let's just add the widget whoops widgets and basically there are where the heck is it oh didn't go far enough okay so basically there's different sizes so basically I had I think the 4x4 four four, and you know they're giving you the size and stuff and then you can set last viewed page latest page and or specified page that you want because you have a bunch of pages that you can have saved in there so let's say the last viewed and that's um, you know what what the last one we looked at so basically if I go in here and I go into um, well let's see now um, let's go into explore and find that one let's just add to it right now um, I just do paint and let's just uh, make it blue as well and now when I go out of course that's saving it when I go out there it is the widgets already changed so that particular note is automatically you know right on there so that's pretty cool and um, so that's called uh, Freenote. So anyways, there's a lot of cool apps for the Galaxy Note. I figured I'd give you a little chance to see uh, what the Galaxy Note can do. You already know it's a 5.3 inch phone that you can do all the same functions with any other Android phone. But with the S Pen, there are many other things that you can do. Uh, to add for your productivity during the day and just as just a few of them of course the kids apps may not be product pro productivity but uh, maybe um, give you a chance to get some work done and have the kids uh, draw so maybe it could be considered that so anyway um, so there you have it and uh, we still have our full review coming up so definitely look for that as well